What up guys, it is me Jules here for WhatCulture.com with my son Ewan and if we're together, that can mean only one thing. It's time for a double news day to hit that double double jingle! Looks like there's news a brewing, guess it's time for Jules and Ewan. Yes mate! And we are back in the room. That Go was on. twice the... That was just twice everything right now. <laughs> Been hitting the news hard today, yeah, haven't we? Yeah, I know. Like a crack pipe. So um, anyway, let's talk comic books again. Yeah. This time we're talking about the potential that uh, Ben Affleck might be stepping away from the whole sort of DCE universe thanks to a report that somebody else is doing a directing on another yeah. project. So, yes, fill, fill us in so yesterday this. Variety, um, who are usually very reliable when it comes mm. to this sort of thing, they said that um, the directors for the upcoming Flashpoint film, why that's a film I don't know, it could just be about the Flash. Gashpoint. But anyway, uh, yeah, there we go, that's... Review it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, so they're pro um, John Francis Daly and Jonathan Goldstein, who did the uh, writing for Spider-Man Homecoming. 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 Yes, yes. They're, um, they're apparently going to direct it. But oh, cool. in, but in cool. that report itself, they also mentioned that Ben Affleck was initially um, kind of a name mooted by the studio, mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. he decided to not do it, which lends further rumours and mm. hearsay and conjecture to all mm. the stuff around his potential absence from the DCU going forward. Because, I mean, that's that's two pieces of big news, really. Mm. It's nice to see that the Homecoming guys are going to get their chance to, see, to show us what they're made of mm -hmm. with uh, Flashpoint. Again, I'm not entirely sure why it's being made into a movie, but who cares? Yeah. At, at the end of the day, more Flash is going to be good for building more Justice League stuff further down the line. However, mm -hmm. with... This news of Affleck, uh, you know, he said that he doesn't really like what he's doing at the moment. He hasn't taken to fan responses on the Justice League very well. Mm. And, you know, he has been, he's said that for a long time he's going to be pulling away. So the fact that he's turned down a project which could have further bolstered his career with DC, mm. it definitely does seem that he's just like, nah, I am done. It very much I'm feels like this. he's had a dream come true moment and it's turned into an absolute nightmare. Because it's <sighs> the same thing with Deadpool, because he loves, he's a big comic book nerd. Mm -hmm, and like, mm -hmm. the chance to play Batman must have been like, oh my god, I'm yeah, going to I mean, play Batman. Everyone yeah. wants that. And now that it's happened and he's not exactly had the, the best avenue <laughs> to... Oh, this yeah. is, but this is the problem, is mm. that the, every film that he's been able to be Batman in, mm. he's been one of the best bits of yes. it. Like, I didn't really like Justice League, I didn't like Batman vs Superman, but I thought that his character, the way he presented Batman, was probably the best bit of yeah, it. Absolutely. So like, he, he gets my thumbs up to be Batman, I would like to see him do this more. But the problem is, is that he clearly doesn't feel that the, the reception of the films themselves yeah. have maybe weighed heavily on And that him. also goes into the whole Matt Reeves Batman movie thing, because I mm. feel like that's becoming the new gambit in the sense that it was yeah. announced ages ago and then it keeps on getting pushed back. Yeah, and, and delayed and, and delayed and, and, and confused. Yeah, so I don't know. Like, obviously, you don't really associate Ben Affleck, who is a big Batman fan, directing a Flash film. Yeah. But if it is... If that's the case, if he was being optioned for that role in the first place, yeah. what does that then say about his other commitments anyway? Yeah, because so, I know yeah. that there's rumours saying that Suicide Squad might be the last time that yes. we ever see him as Batman in there, and that actually has been developing quite a lot of headway and steam. So Jake so, Hall has been muted as a potential replacement, which would be really yeah. cool, by the way. That, yeah, yeah so, but, mm. so not entirely sure what's going on there, but, you know, Affleck, mate, you, you've done pretty well. Like, just take a few hits. Like, I mean, it, it's... I don't know, mate. It's it's up to, it's up to him what he wants to do with his yeah. life. I'm nay his da. But that's been you the news. You are my da. I am your da. Yeah. But yeah, that's been the news. <laughs> Let us know what you thought about it down in the comment section below, whether or not you're happy or sad to see Ben Affleck drop the cowl. As always, though, go back to whatculture.com for more news and articles like this every goddamn day. As always, I've been Jules. This has been my son, my bat family, Ewan. We'll speak to you soon. Now let's make like Ben Affleck and get out of here.